So now when you put you know, a bandage or a coating on the skin, you know it's there, you can feel it, you can see it, and sometimes it can even be uncomfortable. And so the goal was to really create something that was totally invisible, breathable, uh, could coat the skin, protect it, perhaps deliver drugs to it, and also perhaps even make it look better. What we've been able to do is create a cream, basically, that you can put on the skin, and then once it's on the skin, it can actually form essentially an elastic second skin and it's transparent, it's essentially invisible, it's not messy at all, and has good mechanical strength. The way it works is you put it on in two stages. First, you put on this invisible cream on your skin, and that has the polymer in it. And then in the second step, you put on what we call a catalyst, and that causes a cross-linking reaction. And what all this does is it makes a very adherent layer on top of your skin. It's very soft, and yet it's still quite mechanically strong, and it's essentially invisible. So I think it's fair to say that this is a platform technology, and what I mean by that is you could use it in, in various different areas. One set of things might be in cosmetics, where you'd use it to tighten skin in different parts of the body. Another could be for therapeutics, where you'd use it as a whole new kind of plastic ointment that could be used to deliver drugs to the skin to treat different uh, skin diseases. Uh, so there's all kinds of different directions you could take this uh, discovery and this material and move it into. Thank you.